Welcome to the Marin Report. I'm Curtis Kim. Nestled in the San Geronimo Valley is a historical piece of art that is aging away. But with a group of local artists, a movement is now underway to help restore a famous mural. Jenny Chu tells us how you can get involved in refurbishing a local historical treasure. Hidden away in the San Geronimo Valley is a cultural center that holds what some artists are calling a diamond in the rough. I have had the good fortune to be able to exhibit my work in the cultural center here. And of course, when one enters the building, one cannot avoid seeing this incredible mural. And um, the first time I saw it, I was absolutely transfixed. And that's just one way to describe it. Painted in 1934, Maurice Del Mew created this mural as part of the Works Progress Administration Project, or WPA. The WPA was designed to help artists find work during the Great Depression. Since then, Del Mew's 15 by 7 foot mural is a permanent fixture in the Cultural Center lobby. It has captivated people, young and old. I would hope that I would make something that would live on beyond me. I think that is inherent in the artistic um, impulse to create something of beauty or importance that will go on beyond one's, one's lifetime. And certainly in the case of the Del Mew mural, it has in fact done that. I've, I've actually met some older members of our community who have reminiscences as, as children of stepping up to that mural. And it's interesting because of the scale. There are the small children at the lower part of the mural. And they can remember as a small child stepping up to it. And it was as if the mural opened up to them and they had walked right inside of that landscape. So there's a really magical moment there when one encounters work that's so vital and so present in the world. And a legacy is just what Del Mew has left behind. Del Mew was born in Paris, France in 1875, but lived most of his life here in the Bay Area. In 1925, he bought a cottage with his wife and built a studio at home in Marin County. Del Mew was a painter, illustrator, and muralist. Del Mew died at the age of 80. Most people remember him best as a post-impressionist artist, but no one else remembers him better than his great nephew, Tom Wood. He was a very uh, dignified man, very handsome and, and uh, very interesting. He just had a wonderful way of speaking and uh, he lived alone with his dog. He loved his dog, Tootsie. <laughs> and, and he, uh, at the time I knew him, he was still doing easel painting and uh, fine art, although he had uh, retired from his commercial art jobs. And he was just a wonderful guy. He um, uh, lived very frugally, uh, as I recall, and uh, he loved to have the si he loved the simple life, just a just a little wine and French bread and cheese, and he was very European in that sense. And he also smoked, and so I, I just looked at him as a fascinating figure of art. And Maurice Del Mew painted five murals in his lifetime. Two were found at the College of Marin. One was unfortunately destroyed, and the other can still be found on campus. The third is at Mount Tamil Pius High School. The fourth, well, that's a mystery. No one knows who has it or where it is. This, at the San Geronimo Valley Cultural Center, is what sparked the interest of many to start the restoration process. It's actually in, in rather remarkably good condition for its age and for its location and for the materials. Uh, it was very well constructed to start with, and it has been cared for over the years, but it does have some problems that uh, are a result mostly of traffic through the building and uh, a few problems associated with its um, adhesion to the wall and some handling. Ann Rosenthal has been restoring art for the past 25 years. She not only restores the painting, but conserves it as well. Rosenthal's services aren't free. So several local artists put their heads together to come up with a way to raise the money for the restoration. Printmaker Richard Lang decided to sell prints of the mural by digitally enhancing what the painting would look like once it is finished. People are not just donating money, they're getting something in return. And my, my real devotion to artwork is, you know, when you have something in your house that's hanging on the wall, it's, um, it's a navigation point. It's something that, uh, it's no longer about the piece of art itself. It's now you. 
For $250, you can buy a print. 200 of those dollars will go directly to fund the restoration project. But what would Del Mew have thought of all this fuss over his paintings? He would just be delighted. I could, I could almost imagine him now. He would just be a big beaming smile on his face and just say, this is wonderful. I mean, he would, he would just be delighted. The nonprofit organization is hoping to raise $20,000 for the mural restoration itself. The center has been given a grant to start the first examination of the mural. It will also pay for a final protective barrier after the project is complete. In San Geronimo Valley, Jenny Chu for the Marin Report. If you'd like to purchase a Maurice Del Mew print or would like to make a donation to the Mural Restoration Fund, you can contact Susan Lair at 488-9385.